Okay, designistas, this is Tamala again with Hote on Design Part 4. We are one step away from this tree being completed. Now, Part 4 consists of filling in again, but this time what I've done, I filled in with larger than life ornaments and these little picks that I picked up from Hobby Lobby. So, like they say, everything in Texas is big. Well, I believe it, so that's why I have ginormous ornaments. And um, what I've done with the ornaments here, I just insert them inside the tree. I don't actually hang them from the end of the limb because step five is where you hang all your sentimental ornaments or all the ornaments with the bling or the ornaments that have special memories for you. Um, again, the larger-than-life ornaments serve as what? A filler, correct. So you won't have so many holes poking through the tree. So um, these little picks I got from Hobby Lobby, again, 50% off $1.47. And these I got down from the Dallas World Trade Center. Unfortunately, some things I do have to go down to the World Trade Center to get because Hobby Lobby and other places don't carry them. But I want to have a custom looking tree, so sometimes, you know, I have to go that route. But anyway, um, these are the, this is step four, adding in more fillers. And I just wanna briefly show you what I added in. Again, these are picks and spays, um, sprays, I'm sorry, <laughs> spay. Um, you can pick up at Hobby Lobby. This is like a real pretty, um, like a oyster pearl color mixed with gold um, little balls. And again, bigger than life ornaments. I think they may carry these at Hobby Lobby, this size. But the larger than life ornaments, you have to go custom. So if you're looking for the large ornaments, you're not going to find them at Michael's or Hobby Lobby or any, any of the retail stores. You're going to have to go through an interior designer and um, to get these. So if you want some of these, you have to contact me directly and we'll take a little trip down to the World Trade Center and pick you up a few of these. And they come in, oh my gosh, you ought to see the Christmas selection they have in those showrooms down there. It will literally blow you away. But anyways, this is part four, how to decorate a Christmas tree. We have one more video left, that's part five, and that's when the tree will be completely finished. So, stay tuned. Bye for now.